Uh, the president of the German Bishops' Conference is dismissing Vatican concerns over the country's synodal path. The Holy See says it has concerns over a proposal for a new controlling body for the German church. German Bishop Georg Batzing calls those concerns unfounded, but added that the Bishops' Conference would address the Holy See's concerns, quote, in the near future. Joining us now from Rome is Rudolf Gehrig, EWTN Vatican Bureau journalist and producer. Rudolf, great to see you as always. Uh, tell us more about the letter from the Vatican. Good evening, Tracy. The Synodal Way in Germany has been under scrutiny for some time. Not only observers worldwide, but also Catholics directly in Germany have repeatedly expressed their fear that the path this Synodal Way has taken since 2019 could lead to a schism in the Church. The Vatican itself had last expressed the same fears in the fall when the German bishops came to Rome for their ad limina visit. The occasion for the latest letter is the decision of the Synodal Assembly in Germany to establish a so-called permanent Synodal Council as a joint advisory and controlling body. The Vatican sees in this the danger that such a construct will undermine the authority of the bishops and the work of the rightful German Episcopal Conference. And it also actually contradicts church law. And what were some of the specific concerns? In the summer of 2019, a few months before the Synodal Way in Germany even began, the Pope had already set out in his famous letter to the pilgrim people of God in Germany to express what he envisaged by synodality. Since then, the Pope has had to intervene again and again, correcting and admonishing. In yesterday's letter, therefore, there's a decisive sentence. It, I quote, the Holy Father has approved this letter in forma specifica and has ordered its transmission. That means that the Pope takes it into his own hands. It is not the letter of any curial officials, but the mandate and approval comes from Pope Francis himself. And, Rudolf, before I let you go, yesterday the Vatican's letter to the German Bishops' Conference was published, and there was a press conference in Rome on the Worldwide Synod on Synodality. I understand you were there. What can you share with us about that? The press conference was mainly about the ecumenical prayer vigil to be held in St. Peter's Square in September in the run-up to the Synod's first meeting of bishops. In the press conference, I had the chance to ask a question of the Synod's general relator, Cardinal Jean-Claude Hollerich. He told me, there is no plan. There is a listening to the Holy Spirit as the Holy Spirit express himself in the life of people in his church. So... The bottom line is that we know, along with the Vatican's letter to the German bishops, what synodality is not. However, where the synod on synodality will lead, time will show us, and according to Cardinal Hollerich, hopefully the Holy Spirit. All right, Rudolf, thank you so much. Rudolf Gehrig, EWTN Vatican Bureau journalist and producer. Thank you again.